Welcome to this section, section one. Uh, section one will be creating a vampire girl. We'll be sculpting it all in ZBrush as part of this painting, printing, and sculpting miniatures course um, that you can find a link to below. So I'll be showing you a plethora of methods for creating this cool looking uh, sexy vampire girl that's uh, sitting on a rock. So after I've finished actually sculpting all of this, showing you numerous techniques in anatomy and sculpting hair and stone rocks and doing replacements for hands and feet, we'll then be exporting this out and actually printing it out on the Anycubic Photon S. I will then show you how to clean that up and prime it and paint it to a final figure. So this course is really comprehensive. This is workshop one, which is the Sexy Vampire Girl, and we'll be moving on throughout the year to other sections that are being added to the course all through this year, and possibly through next year as well. So it's gonna be pretty in depth. There is a free section on how to work with the Photon S, if you just want to look at how your Photon S works but um, this course is very thorough so if you're into painting miniatures for D&D &D, those sort of games then uh, this is the course for you for sure because I show you the whole pipeline from sculpting to printing to painting for the final finished version so as you can see in this figure we're actually doing the clothes as well and we are actually posing her again I'll be showing you a ton of different methods for creating quite realistic figures that you print out on your photon. I really hope that you enjoy this course and I have an active Facebook group that's a closed group for members of the course to debate ideas, talk about new projects uh, that I can actually turn into sections for you. So it's a very very thorough course. If you know my courses by now you'll see how much detail I pay to uh, putting into it. Most of the the assets are supplied with this course as well. This one is an exception. I'm not supplying her, but I show you all the techniques to get this finished result for the vampire girl. So I hope you enjoy this course. Check out the link below and have a look and see what you think.